Well, I'm doing something I haven't done before, and that is I'm, I'm actually, this is not a fake background behind me. This is where we're living right now in Florida. And you can see behind me, um, beautiful, exquisitely beautiful area. We're living, and let me switch this around. So I'll, I'll do the opposite. So maybe I'll be able to switch it to the other side. Video here, let's see, is that working? Okay, so if you look down, this there's this house here, and then there's a house next to it where you see a car, and then there's a third house with a blue boat. That's the house where we're staying right now, the one with the blue, the light blue boat. And then this is the area where we're staying. And so you can see how close we are. And this is where we are. It's a river, but it's kind of a special river. It's a river that actually is um, about one kilometer from the ocean. So it's really close. And we've been staying here um, for, well, several months now. Um, and we're waiting for the vaccine to come out that we're all hoping is going to come out. We heard it's been approved in the UK, so we're assuming it's going to be approved in the US soon. Uh, we won't be the first people to get it. We would be the third group of people to get it. People living, well, first doctors and nurses and and police officers and people like that will get it first because they're the ones that get exposed. And then the second people are people who are old and in nursing homes. And the third group of people will be the people who are old, who are not in nursing homes, and that would be us. Now. It may be too much wind and it may make the sound really awful. So I won't say much today. I just wanted to kind of see where we live. Thought you might be interested in that. And this isn't our home. It's not yet. But my brother owns this home. And so what my brother has done is he has allowed us to stay in it. He doesn't live here. He lives pretty far away, actually. He lives about 12 hours away by driving. And um, I'm just going to bring you over to my house just because you might be interested to see it this one time. Sorry, it's kind of bumpy and barefoot today. That's my feet. So this where we live is not cold, not very cold, although it was very cold yesterday. It was six below zero yesterday when we started. Um, but where we live, this is my brother's house. This is my brother's boat. And this is his house. And there's the porch. And here's the backyard. So just walk right across the grass here. And this is where we live every day. So we're right on the water. And like I said, we are literally one kilometer away from the ocean. So we can walk to the ocean, but we usually drive. We always drive, we only walked once. Um, and so what we do, it's, it's low tide right now, which means the water's down, it goes up and down twice a day. And then you can see all of these shells down here, see? And okay, that proves that we're in the US. And that also proves we're in the US. And so what we do every day, I've, I've been gone for two weeks as we've been up north. Well, <laughs> north of us anyway, but I've been gone for two weeks celebrating American Thanksgiving. Uh, and this is the porch. So what we've been doing, what I've been doing here is I'm doing all my work here, working 12 hours a day. I'm not, I'm not goofing off. I'm working hard here, um, very hard. Yeah, but what we've been doing is, um, I've been doing working 12 hours a day, but I've been working 12 hours a day here. So it's not hot like Pakistan because we're next to the ocean and the ocean has breezes and the ocean is much cooler than the air. And so it cools things off. It means we get lots and lots and lots of rain. Every afternoon we get rainstorms, although that's in the fall. I don't know about now. 
and summer too. We've got lots of rain in the summer too. So I want you to know I'm praying for all of you, praying for each one of you by name. I, and I will say that I'm praying that God will get us back to Pakistan. But because I'm 65, 66 years old and my wife is 65, um, we're not going to go back until we have a vaccination um, because we want to be vac vaccinated first and then not have the complications of getting sick and going to the hospital. And we don't know how things are done in Pakistan as far as that goes. And, and we don't, I mean, the only family I have is my wife and myself and the uh, Hoga. So we don't want that, okay? So God bless you all. And um, I so much wish I could be in class or even better yet, that you all could be here with us. So God bless you all and take care.